Blues is a 12 bar form. If you had to make a graph of it, I guess it would be a circle because it goes around and then when you get to the end of it, it starts all over again. And as I said, this form is very, very important to jazz music. It's a very basic structure. Uh, and the blues, uh, and, and um, as I said, it's, it's uh, parallel to, to the symphony form and the sonata form. Now, I want to show you how that works. I'm going to ask John to play a bass line. Now, he's going to be what we call in, in jazz walking. He, in, uh, he won't be playing a rhythm like he did in, in Night in Tunisia. He'll just be walking along with the bass. And you're going to hear how it's a 12, how it's 12 bars. We'll count one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I'm going to ask Earl, 11, 12, give us some rhythm behind the bass. One, two, two, three, four. Polyrhythmic already, even with two people. Now, keep it going, guys. Now, this is what happens sometimes when we're playing in the club. And everybody, and, and, and it's always a table that's right smack in front of the bandstand. And they want to groove and they're feeling good about it. Now, one of the things about Western African music is that the balance of that music is different from the balance of Eurocentric music. Now, if we're doing a march, it's going to be one, two, one, two. If we're doing a waltz, as I mentioned, it's going to be one, two, three, one, two, three. But now when we're doing this, we're going to move to two, three, four, two, four, two. So the balance, the weight of that rhythm is on the two and the four. Now, I'm going to want you to try it. We'll come around and Pito, you can join us this time. And I'm going to have you do it. Just do it on one and three. Here we go. One second. One, two, three, four. Ready, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. You know, usually, uh, um, you know, when, when they get up and they play, they play several choruses. And we're going to play several choruses a piece now on this. And we're going to do um, Billy Strayhorn's piece, which became the orchestral signature for Duke Ellington's band, and that's Take the Entry. train <laughs> Thank you. 
Thank you. John Robinson on bass. Earl Williams on drums. Hito Castillo on congas. Dr. Valerie Capers. Dr. Valerie Capers. Thank you very much. Thank you so much.